Hi everyone, it's Diane Yetter again from the Sales Tax Institute for another episode of our Women to Watch in Sales Tax. And today I am thrilled to have Chandler Alm with me. She is the Accounting Manager at Kitchen Cabinet Distributors in Raleigh, North Carolina. Welcome Chandler. Thank you, glad to be here. Uh, so Chandler, why don't you tell everybody what uh, Kitchen Cabinet Distributors does and what your role as an Accounting Manager is? Yep, I'm the accounting manager over at Kitchen Cabinet Distributors, and we sell cabinets across uh, the United States. Um, we've grown exponentially over the last few years. Um, we've stayed dedicated to our, you know, customer service and the, our product quality. But my primary role is reporting and compliance. Perfect. And is there something, Chandler, that you've accomplished in the sales tax area that you're especially proud of? I'm really proud to say that we've built a strong review process around our sales tax obligations, um, including monthly reconciliations. Our team has um, implemented a customer certificate management solution for our customer exemptions. Um, and we've really just been dedicated to expanding our knowledge around sales tax issues so that when our customers have concerns or questions, we can answer their questions effectively and accurately. And I'm really proud to be a part of a team that is really striving to focus on our sales tax concerns that come up. That That is a great accomplishment. And, and in your business, because, you know, who are you selling to? You know, are you selling to a contractor? Or are you selling to a big box store? You know, it, right. it really differs as to whether or not an exemption can apply exactly. and, and what has to happen. So you are not in an easy business. So congratulations on that. That is something to be proud of. Thank you. Um, so Chandler, as a woman working in a business where mm -hmm. sales tax isn't your only responsibility, mm -hmm. do you have any recommendation to somebody that might be in that same position? Yeah, um, just be an advocate for your business. Obviously, you have to balance the many different responsibilities, but um, don't let sales tax slip through the cracks. Mishandled sales tax issues at a small company level can really um, grow into a bigger problem as you grow, especially when you're in a period of growth, when you're selling into multiple states, you want to make sure you have um, sight on those issues. So be an advocate for your business. Don't be afraid to speak up and bring issues to your leadership team um, to help make good business decisions around your sales tax obligations. You know, Chandler, that is excellent advice. Um, and, and I, you know, we talk to a lot of businesses that are small companies and they're like, ah, it's not that much money right now. I'm not going to worry about it. But you're right. When you're in that fast growth, it can yep. very easily ramp up and become something um, that is an uncomfortable uh, situation to deal with. So that is great advice. Thank you so much. And um, if you are a woman working in sales tax and you would like to be considered uh, to join me in this conversation, just drop a note to me um, and we will uh, get that scheduled. So Chandler, thank you so much. And we look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye. Thank you.